You're now at the eastern end of the lagoon and this is Zane Moss who is a fish and game officer. Now obviously Zane in your job you deal with a lot of people that are here for recreation. Why do they come to Waituna Lagoon? Uh, well Waituna is a special place uh, and it appeals, the environment itself appeals to people who want to come here and, and fish for trout particularly. Um, all guys that come here waterfowl hunting, duck hunting, there's a long culture associated with people coming here to hunt waterfowl. Um, so yeah it's a very special place, unique environment, it's obviously often quite windswept, it's quite rugged, it's kind of wildernessy even though it's close to Invercargill, fairly big centre. Um, and there's really good trout numbers here, and good, good condition, good healthy fish. So. Okay, so lots of trout. What makes this environment good for trout? Uh, well, it's a really productive ecosystem. Trout obviously feed on insects and small fish in ecosystems. They require pretty good water quality, um, and they require the whole ecosystem to be fairly intact. So macrophyte weed beds in the lagoon, they need those to be healthy so the whole ecosystem is connected. Uh, so there's a lot of food in this environment, so the trout grow well as a consequence of that. So Zane, what would you like to see people doing to help Waituna to make sure that fishing can still continue here? Sure. Well obviously there's very real concerns about the water quality coming into the lagoon. That's deteriorated uh, and the health of the ecosystem, the health of the rupia beds uh, has deteriorated. And if that gets much worse, there's a real risk that the lagoon flips. If that happens, uh, the trout and everything else that live in the ecosystem will suffer uh, and the whole nature of the lagoon will change. People won't want to come and fish here anymore um, and a whole host of other values will be compromised unless we can improve water quality that's coming into the lagoon. Mm, another good reason to look after Waituna Lagoon.